Hey there, this is Adam Lane from Pocketnow.com, and if you're an Xbox fan, you probably know that there are a number of little Xbox Live programs available for different smartphone operating systems. But how do they compare? Let's check them out. You can probably guess that Windows Phone would have the uh, best Xbox integration. So let's check that one out first. Here we have the Games Hub, and we have lots of Xbox Live games that actually do affect your uh, Xbox Gamer Score. So that's a, a pretty big deal for some of the achievement junkies out there. And here's our avatar. We have profile. You can see that. You can see the achievements and friends that are online, messages. You can read messages that you get, but you can't listen to audio messages. So we see requests. Uh, there's your friends and messages again. And we have a spotlight. So you can see a few of these and they link to a web page normally. And we have an avatar button which uh, goes to the Xbox Live Extras app. So it's a, a separate app that you have to download. And then from here you can customize your avatar. Let's change my style. And we'll get a suit. How about that one? And you can see your character, spin them around, and changes out like that. There's also the marketplace where you can get different avatar items and they're all there so let's get out and you also have a separate app called Xbox Companion so Xbox Companion is kinda like the precursor to the smart glass feature that was shown off earlier and from here we can see featured items, we can see quick play let's launch Crackle and it's going to start the, the app on my console over there. And here's the remote where I can control it using these buttons. Press back and we see there's information about what's playing on the console right now. You can also do searches from here. There's no voice search, but we can type it in. And we can always get back to the remote and use this to control the console. So now I can hear something's playing on the console and now I can pause it like that. And there's your controller right back in there and we got all the controls there. So that's pretty cool integration with the Xbox. Now on iOS we have a different app for Xbox integration. It's called My Xbox Live. And this is what we have. We have a bunch of videos about upcoming games. And we can swipe to the side. And this is where our social area is. You see my gamer score, friends, messages, beacons. And uh, that little icon will let us see the messages. Again, you can't listen to them. There's our friends. And if we swipe again, we see the recent games and how many achievements we have for each one. And then here is the companion app kind of integrated with the iOS uh, Xbox app. So here we go. You're trying to connect, but it doesn't really work. You know, it's set on the Xbox that so it tried to connect. Oh, and there we go. Now it's working. And from here, we now we have controller. So I can control my Xbox uh, from this little device. And you notice we do not have search, but we have quick play for uh, recent apps on the Xbox. And here's a, a discover section, some featured items. If we hit that, and we can choose to play it on the Xbox. So now that's going to go over to the Xbox and change my content. 
Of course, back in the social, we still have our ability to change the avatar clothing. There, so change our style. But we do not have the avatar store. So you can't uh, go and buy new clothing or, or props or whatnot. <laughs> so that's the iOS app for Xbox Live. A kind of a second place to the Windows Phone version. So lastly, let's see the Android version of my Xbox Live. So it starts out with a spotlight, similar to iOS, and we can scroll through and see these videos. And we also have a refresh button at the bottom, and you see the little dots at the bottom means we can swipe. So there's our social section, you can see your friends. You can see messages. And down here we can see the avatar editing area. So that's going to load our style and features. We can change clothing. But you do not have access to the store, just like on iOS. Next up we have games, which just lists uh, the games you played and which kind of achievements you've unlocked. There's no Xbox Companion integrated with this app just yet. So uh, hopefully we'll see that later on when Smart Glass becomes more uh, integrated with the Xbox. So they have a quick uh, little comparison between the Xbox Live features available on Windows Phone, iOS, and Android. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and thanks for watching.